Iran. Coronavirus death toll in 404 cities surpasses 95,500. Over 95,500 people have died of the novel coronavirus in 404 cities checkered across all of Iran's 31 provinces. According to reports tallied by the Iranian opposition, People's Mujahideen Organization of Iran, as of Thursday afternoon local time. The official death count declared by the regime stands at 21,137, around the fifth of the actual figure. If we enter a third wave, there will be a major difference this time around. Our medical society, nurses, hygiene professionals, and paraphysists are tired and overfatigued, said Deputy Health Minister Iraj Harirchi on Wednesday. He emphasized that 164 medical professionals have died and two members of the medical staff in the Revolutionary Guards Hospital in Tehran died on Wednesday, according to a report aired on the state TV. Iran. Security forces fire shotgun pellets at protesting villagers. Security forces attacked locals in Hazrat Abul Faz village with pellet guns and tear gas during protests against the demolition of their village on Wednesday. Locals in the Abul Faz village in Ahvaz, capital of Iran's Khuzestan province, were protesting the destruction of their homes and confiscation of their lands by one of Iran's wealthiest bonyad, owned by the regime's supreme leader, the Mossad Afan Foundation. According to local sources, several protesters were also detained. Mrs. Maryam Rajavi, the president-elect of the National Council of Resistance of Iran, strongly condemned the criminal attack by the repressive forces on the village of Abul Faz Kion Shari Nahwaz and the destruction of the homes of the destitute villagers. She hailed the residents of Abul Faz village, who defended their lives and homes with empty hands and defied the repressive forces. Mrs. Rajavi called on the people of Ahwaz and his brave youth to rush to their assistance.